All right, so we're at Kelly Special Care Home, myself, Mr. Leonard, and uh, we're here today to uh, do some tech with seniors. And the whole focus of today is to bring some of the, uh, the gadgets and the gizmos and some of the equipment that the students are working with in the makerspace on the road. And uh, we're here in Quarryville at uh, an establishment that has 15, uh, 15 seniors. And we got some uh, stations set up inside. And essentially, uh, we're just uh, showcasing and demoing the tech that we were doing at the school. Yeah, some of the tech we have in there right now, we have some micro bits going. So some of the grade 7 students are playing rock, paper, scissors with the micro bits. Some of the high school students are uh, showing the seniors how to use the Sphero, and some of the seniors are actually driving it around uh, the, the space. So pretty cool. And the 3D printer. And there's a lot of other cool tech going on in there, too, that you'll see in the videos. And we're excited to have uh, one of our uh, practice teachers with us, Miss Melissa Berry. And uh, she's going to do some music here shortly, and I'm, uh, I'm sure the uh, seniors will enjoy that. And uh, we programmed some robots to actually uh, sync with her music. So we're going to go inside and we're going to check it out. And we'd like to say a big thanks to iHub Learning for Absolutely. paying for the trip to come down here. And uh, Brian Labs has been uh, supportive with all the equipment in our makerspace to be able to bring this tech gadgets on the road. we got to have the support of those uh, partners. So thank you, iHub and Brilliant Labs. Kiefer Crawford and Sarah Vanerbeck test out their M-Bot to show the folks at Kelly's how cool little robots are. Deanna Norton, Emmy Lee Jardine and Paige Gorman show off their Sphero bot as well. Look at that little bot go! Hi, Chris Runner Hill. This is uh, Jenna Coulter and Vanessa Strasser. We are the 3D printers for today. We are showing the folks here how, to, how, to, how it works and how to do it. So right now we're making a tiny little Easter bunny from the spirit of Easter. Uh, it's probably it's a very small print, very fast to get done. Uh, thank you, Abby and Malcolm, for throwing that on there. And um, yeah, it should be done pretty soon. Here we got a couple of things. We got a little hedgehog, Sam's Carl, Sarah Carl. Hi. We got a uh, little. This is from an old. This is from the N64 Nintendo logo for it. You know, came out pretty, pretty neat. Thanks. Okay. Here's Deanna teaching some of the elderly how to drive the Sphero bot themselves. Hi, Sarah. This is how fast it goes. So if I do my job, I'll go faster. Hi, I'm Jada McDonald, and today we're making buttons with Marty Zen, Stephen Brophy, and Jared Manderman. And we're teaching them how to make buttons with the button maker and the cutters. Students at Blackville are no strangers to making buttons. Throughout our Hockeyville campaign, buttons were made by the second to help promote, and it certainly did. Right now, they're making Kelly's special care home buttons for the folks. Now here's Mrs. Melissa Berry playing her violin. Fantastic performance.
that we are Hockeyville, right? That's a big announcement for Renews, right? That's cool. And Jada composed a song, right? Written to Dolly Parton's 9 to 5. And uh, we got Chris around here. We'll need Chris to jump in with any announcements today because we already got the vote done, right? So he uh, was our voice that said to get people out to vote and they came voting in droves, right? So we did our job there. So we're gonna get Melissa and Jada to do the 9 to 5. And then after that, what we'll probably do is if you guys want to see a little bit more tech, maybe five, ten minutes, and then we're going to start to tear our stuff down and we got to head back to school, right? So, we'll let the nine to five happen. Ready? Yeah. Okay, here we go. So I'm like, I gotta get to my computer, smartphone, tablet, you can use either and for news and bring the ring to life. All around the nation, the votes are coming. Better believe we're doing it for Thomas. Folks like us are voting nine to five. Voting 9 to 5, what a way to come together Cause we're never done, it's all voting, never stopping We just get her done, there's no ifs or buts about it We got 32 hours, so let's go out and get it 9 to 5, what a way to remember We are Hockeyville, there's no doubt about it The Tom Donovan We'll have a lasting future, cause we're never done, so let's go out and get it! Woo! So I gotta give a shout out to Judy, right? To take in a risk, right? To have 35 students come to her special care home, right? Which is awesome. Um, the plan is that we're hoping to be back. 
right? Um, we're hoping to be back in early May with some high school students again. Um, we'll bring some of the top gadgets. We got a vibe from you guys what you like. So we're going to bring some of our top gadgets back. And we're going to come with a snack. Our Cold Tech class is going to cook something up for you guys. So we're going to bring some food with us and have a little celebration. And then uh, hopefully, I mean, you guys can come up and see us at the school sometime, right? Because we're open to the community and have you come out and check us out. On the 22nd, we're doing a grand opening of our whole space. And uh, it's really cool that you guys got to hang out with some students today and see some of our gadgets. And uh, hopefully uh, you guys enjoy, right? Very good time. Cool.